Please listen carefully. Hey everybody, Dan here from Canadian Craft Beer Collective. Today we're up Parallel 49, chatting with the head brewer, Graham. And these guys just said, you just had the big brewery awards, BC Brewery Awards this weekend. Tell me about it. Yeah, we picked up four awards, which is great. Uh, and one of the awards we picked up is a gold medal uh, for our lager. Beautiful. What else did you guys get? Uh, we picked up a couple one-off beers and uh, our Russian Imperial Stout we aged in whiskey barrels. Picked up uh, bronze as well. Awesome. So why don't we talk a little bit more about the craft lager while I pour away. Yeah, so this is a sort of German-influenced lager, uh, kind of model after, after a German Helles. Uh, we use German-style hops and a German yeast. It ages for over a month in conditioning. Uh, smooth, crisp, and highly drinkable. Well, let's 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 put that to the test. Cheers. Cheers. Oh yeah, nice and clean. That's great. Can you tell me a little more about the German style hop? What, uh, what makes a German style hop? Well, exactly? the hops we use are called noble hops. So mm -hmm. there's a few varieties of hops that have been around for a, a long time, and they're very characteristic. Uh, sort of the classic European beers that you get. We use one called Hallertau Middle Fruit, mm -hmm. and that one is a staple of a German lager. So is that actually, would that be a seed that essentially was brought over from Europe? Uh, they don't grow it here, so okay. we have to actually get the hops from Germany oh, okay. in order to make this beer. So it's a true German hop. It is, yes. Got it. That's great. Well, Graham, thanks for having us today. We really appreciate it. For everyone out there, uh, thanks for tuning in to Canadian Craft Beer Collective. Don't forget, these beers are now available across Asia. Uh, they're about to come into Singapore probably over the next month, so look out for it. And thanks for tuning in. Cheers.